Hey everybody, welcome back to my studio. I'm Rory, and I just got my hands on these awesome. Don't they look like they've been coffee stained? But they haven't. They they just they just came this way, and I was just like, yay! So I wanted to make a piece of ephemera for our Christmas journal, and I think I'm gonna use this one because I plan on only using the front, so we can trim all that off and and you know grunge it up some more and add some stuff so i'm gonna put these to the side and we'll just start cutting this up and let's see scissors that would be great <laughs> okay so i'm just going to trim all of this off like so and whoops come on in the garbage Let's see what else. Um, we wanted to open it up too. So let's see. I hope this opens up easily. I've been working all morning on ephemera for the Christmas journal. And my hands are all inky and glued up. <laughs> well, hello. <laughs> Has to make her her presence known. And now she's gonna work at something she hears in the front yard. Okay, it's open. Now I think yeah, we don't need this back flap, so I'm gonna take that off. Flip it over. Makes it easier. Come on. Half the time, she doesn't even know what she's barking at. She just hears something a million miles away with those ears of hers. She's got huge ears for a chihuahua. Okay. We can save that for something else. And we're going to take these tabs off, too, because we don't need them either. Bark, bark. Bark, bark, bark. Come on. Oh my gosh. Scissors don't want to work today, or my hands don't want it to. Okay. So now I'm going to take this and I'm going to fold it in half. This is going to go, it's going to wrap around the page. So when the page is here, this will be a pocket and this will be a pocket. So yeah, that looks cool so far. So let's, we're gonna collage some things on here, I think. Oh, uh, let's see. I have all these bits and pieces that I was using earlier. And let's see, some music paper might be cool. I'm gonna get a glue page out, if I can find it. Yep. Here we go. I don't use these very often, but sometimes I do. Get my, uh, yeah, ink it. She has no idea what she's barking at. Such a busy body. We'll just go ahead and ink it again after we get it up there. <laughs> as soon as I turned the camera on, she was perfectly quiet until then. Okay. So I'm going to put that here and we'll snip that off and we'll use this other piece somewhere a little 
put it over here like that. Since it was glued, why not? Let's see. Unrivaled plum pudding. Yeah. Put that there. So we'll tear off the bottom portion of it. And inky, inky, inky. I've got some of my, uh, that Christmas, um, washi tape. We're going to use some of that too and see how it turns out. It looks really good on the tags I made, so that's a good thing. Put that there. So how has everybody's week been so far? Pretty good? I hope so. Let's see. Let's trim this down. Oh, da -dum -da -dum. Oh, looks like it's upside down. Yeah, it is. So, yeah, it's been oh, around here. <laughs> been very interesting. Dad's still in the nursing home, but he's doing really, really well. And we're hoping he'll be home for Thanksgiving, which is great. And it's looking like he will be. So... That's always a good thing. I miss the old boy around here. See how great that looks? That looks so good. Let's see what else we got. We need some other scrubby scraps. Uh, coconut cake. <laughs> We have some pieces of this stuff we can borrow from it. This is from the kit that I'm even using. Yeah, that almost fits perfectly. Awesome. <coughs> Excuse me. See if we need real glue for this. I don't think the uh, glue stick will work for this one. I can't wait to uh, show everybody this journal because it's really really cool and i've been having a ball putting it together really have been nope let's see <clears throat> what else can we put on here i need something bright or brighter Well, let's see. Nope. Huh. Trying to find leftovers. Oh, we have leftovers. Do we ever? Let's see what I can't dig out of here. Because I have this from the kit. And we got bits and pieces in here. Along with, oh, here we go. Da 
that'll work. Some of this paper will work. What else we got here? Just all sorts of goodies. Okay. This will be a bigger help. Yeah, this is come Saturday. <coughs> Excuse me again. We're going to be putting all the ephemera in, pockets, tucks, all the cards. It's going to be awesome. Definitely. So that's going to be on the live feed. And that'll be Saturday at 5 o'clock. We have a good time over there. And it's going to be fun. Especially to finish off this journal. It's going to be awesome. <coughs> mm, I've got a frog in my throat or something. All right. So we're going to snip this out. And this little card. And this is just the edging from the paper, the 12 by 12s. And they're so cute. And I, <laughs> if you saw my, my live feed last Saturday, you'll know that, uh, let me put this like right, mm, no. Mm, we don't want it. This looks like it's hanging over. There we go. There. That'll look good there. But, uh, yeah. <clears throat> One of the books that I purchased off of Amazon was a total disaster. But I was actually able to use it and make all the pages work. I even used the cover which was interesting very interesting but it looks awesome i'm gonna put a piece of washi across the bottom here too <clears throat> just a little piece yeah like that but yeah i'm really proud that we were i was able to get it all used because I don't I didn't leave a shred not a shred of anything useful it was all used and I like that I like being able to use an entire book or kit or you know and not leave anything behind I mean, you pay good money for that, you know? Why would you want to waste any of it? But they had printed, like, a sheet for journal pages, and then on the back side, more journal pages, but they were upside down. Yeah. I was not impressed. <laughs> really was not impressed. I was like, who is the idiot that edited this book? So, but I got it to work. Oh, this holly, it's so pretty. This, uh, paper pack that I bought has just been so much fun to work with. It really has been. I think we're going to add that right there. You see, we still have more we have to trim off, which is fine.
Why does that still look white? There we go. And down it goes. This is called Cherry Stockings. I did not know that's what it was called. And the item number is CBCH89011. Made by Cartabella Paper Company. And I got it on Amazon. And I just absolutely love the colors. There we go. Let's trim that little bit of paper off. Like so. <clears throat> Let's put some of this down this way. Maybe some of that coming down this way. Still have to put something there though too. That's okay. I'll just bend that over so I know where to cut it. Oh, we've got the other side too. That'd be cute. Okay. That's what another thing I like about this paper pack is two. It's double sided, you know, and both sides are. I think there was one sheet I was kind of like, mm. but uh, yeah, it was. It's super cute. We want to use the plaid again, or we want to use the that? Hmm. Or do we want to use this for there? That actually fits better. I think this side. Then we can use this for fill in there. Yep, 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 yep. I want to bend it right there. This kit has a real homey feel to it, and it's just almost like farmhouse type. It's really adorable, very old fashioned looking, and I just love that. I absolutely love that. There we go. And now something right there. That is so cute. Do we need a focal point for here? I know. I'm gonna grab the sticker sheet that came with this kit and see what we can't come up with here. I like this Christmas sticker here. I like the red. And We'll offset it just a little bit. There we go. That looks cute there. I think I need something over here. Let's put <clears throat> a stocking. And I'm going to darken this up because it's a little bright. go and we'll put it right there that's cute 
that's adorable. Now we need to make something to go into the pockets. So, I need to trim that off. It is just sticking way up. Let's see. Yeah, that looks better. So we need a card to go in here. Hmm. And a tuck here. Let's see. I think I've got... I wonder if this will fit. Yep, that'll fit in there once it's glued. That'll be great. Okay. <clears throat> so let's make a tag out of this. Don't want to use any more of that. An excellent plum pudding. Made without eggs. They can you can write on the back of that. So let's put this down on here. Move this out of the way real quick. And we'll glue this down. Let's let me try it backwards. Okay. And then we'll take this and put it key wampus. And there's some glue up here, which is okay, because we can put stuff there. Let's see. Yeah. Oops, get over. Scoot your hiney. There we go. Yeah, let's see. We want something maybe down here. Um, ooh, I know. That's another sticker. Place it. We know this is seasonal in winter. That's come on. Of course it is. It's plum pudding. Flip it and trim it. I think I might just round the corners a little bit. Just a wee bit. And put a tab on it. There we go. Put a little something on there. Um, let's see, what do we have? make a tab out of. Um, <laughs> let's find a piece of... Oh. There we go. Uh -huh. Come on, fingers, pick it up. And my little one. I want the poinsettia in the front, I think. And the other side. And a little bit 
glue. Take a glue right here and right here. And place in the center. There. Okay, and that will go into this pocket. That'll look good. So we're gonna make one larger one. Unless I already have one that'll fit. <clears throat> Let's see. If I have one that will fit it already. I might. I have a lot of different cards and whatnot. I mean, this whole bay is filled with ephemera just for the Christmas journal. Oh, goodness. It's loaded. Okay, corner tucks. More corner tucks. Pocket. 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 It might fit in there, but it won't show through the windows right. A little booklet. I know I've got some that are sideways. I don't know if they're going to be too big. Yep, too big. Let's keep looking. Is supposed to be a pocket. Pockets, pockets, pockets. I have a bunch of tags, but they're all squatty and square. I don't have much that's. Nope. Okay, so we're going to have to make one. Let's put this to the side. And see what we can't find over here. Nothing. <laughs> Let's delve back into the bag of scraps. If I don't have anything that would look neat through the through the ooh, but wait, will that will he go through the window? I might be able to trim it up. This is one of the pages out of the book, and this is one of the few that was correct side up. Hmm, I may still save this for something though. Let's see what else. Lots of holly. These are all too square. Yes, we're going to have to start from scratch. And here's a page we haven't even touched yet. Actually, we got two pages we haven't touched yet. So, but this one's got the stripes, so we might be able to get it to where it'll line up in the windows just right. So let's try that. Hey, bud. Okay. Let's see. Oh, look at that. That's like, it fits perfectly. Hmm. Oh, come on, everybody. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> it's a mess around here. Okay. I think that would be, that'd be cute with the little, but that's, uh, no, that trees, oh, 
oops, wait. Live for the moments you can't put into words. Nope, that's not gonna work. That is actually the only one that will work. Possibly. Let's go ahead and mark where we want it, where we need to cut it. So we want here. To basically here and then we'll figure out the height okay time to bring in a cutter okay let's see to the side. I hope this isn't going to look weird. Let's see. That looks like it'll fit. You just don't want this there. But it's pretty on the back. I think I'm still going to cover it with some uh, like old paper, coffee stain paper, because uh, I'm just going to leave that edge of black. I wish you a Merry Christmas. Okay, where did the paper go? I just had it. Is it buried? Of course it is. Okay. And if it's too big, we can still trim it down. That's why we, you know, we can trim it all the way up to this comma here, which would be great. And then take off some on that side too, just in case. Just in case. So, flip that over. Because I want the gold to show. So is everybody else making a Christmas journal too? Or do you say, nah, not this year? And what are you working on? I want to know. I think I'm going to turn this down here. Oh. <sighs> I always have issues trying to pick a theme for a Christmas journal. There's so many different ones out there. They're so pretty. You've got the pink with the blues and just all pinks. And it's just it's so much to choose from. Really, it can get crazy. 
going to take these little corners off. There we go. Now this is going to need something. What, what, what? Ribbon. We need ribbon. Here it is. Right in front of my face. I'm going to use this green and red shiny ribbon. I think that'd be pretty. We still have stamping yet to do on the pages and everything. So we put that there. I think that's pretty. It's got the green and red and the gold in it. And I can cover up that black. Okay, so that's what we're going to do. I'm going to drag out some Fabri-Tac because it dries faster. I mean, I, I love my Fabric Fusion by Eileen's and it's fine when I'm doing, you know, my streaming because I've got time, but when I'm doing a video, you need things that'll actually dry a little faster. There we go. And just right on that black line. When it's just peeking over. <laughs> Let me see, where's my... Wow, these are gooped up. Time to clean the scissors. We still need to put a tab on, I think, because this is going to sit down inside, so we need something to help pull it up out of there with. So, time to make another tab. Should we? Use, I don't want to use the black one again. That's way too black. We need. Where's the red? I know I have, oh, wait a minute. This might be different. See that? And this thing is sticky. I'm just going to nip the little corners off. Make it look a little more finished. And let's uh, grunge it up just a bit. Because it's... We need this color. This is just a vintage photo I'm using. Okay. And in the middle. There we go. 
That looks good. Ta-da. Let's ink the edges uh, just a wee bit. And this will be done. Alrighty. Close that up. Awesome. Now, I can put this into the journal. Um, but I can't show you the journal cover because it's got a special reveal that I will be doing. And Saturday's live stream, no one's gonna get to see this. <laughs> but I'm gonna go ahead and I'll open it off, open it up off camera and show you how we're gonna put this and the journaling, where's that other journaling card? Oh, I put it with the other stuff. So, while well, everything's falling, stay put. Okay, and this little journey card here. So, we're going to put this into the journal and then put the little journaling cards in it. So, let's pick a page. It's going to have to be one that doesn't have... See, this is interesting. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. We're gonna have to trim that off because it's too wide. Too wide. That's okay. Not a problem. As long as we don't cut off all of the stocking, we're good. Alrighty. So, what we're going to do, make sure this fits now. Yeah, that works just fine. Okay. So, we're going to grab our tacky glue. And we're going to go down this way. Down this way. All the way. And then up. Alrighty. <laughs> and we will put this here. Pull it out a little bit so it has a folding room. And down. <sighs> we got glue everywhere. Oh, grab something to wipe that off with. Just one. Here's our cards. And this one will go in here. This one will not fit in there. <laughs> like I said, I knew we were gonna end up having to shorten it. I had a feeling. And that's not a problem. Because all we do is we just come right inside here to the edge of the W and come straight up. And then I'm gonna come down here to just this side of the W there. Oh, 
Alrighty. And then all we have to do is re corner our corners. <laughs> re corner our corners. cardboard done. I didn't take the fabric. Here we go. And these little corners here. so cute and now it fits there we go awesome ah page is gonna get ruined we're gonna have to put something down there let's put some washi tape Which one do we want? Something with the yellow. Oh, the one that says season greetings. That works. There we go. That'll work. Straighten that up. It's a little crooked. Yes, the washi tape covers all sins. And this probably will get a pocket over it anyway, so I'm not worried about that page either. And we will just put this down like so. And <laughs> it's not gonna tear. A million bucks. Here we go. I like that raggedy edge. It looks cool. All right, that's it. That is a wraparound pocket, and I think that came out adorable. Oh, I like it. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So this is the first piece of ephemera put in. And it looks great. So yeah, thank you very much for coming, guys. I appreciate you watching my video. And uh, yeah, if you want to check out us putting the rest of the ephemera into this beauty, uh, please come by Saturday. And uh, I mean, if you can't make it Saturday, I, I get it. I get it. Um, I will be doing a regular flip through to put up to show everybody what we've done. And, uh, yeah, but I love this album. I can't wait to show you guys the cover. <laughs> so make sure you keep your eyes open for either the live feed on Saturday or the flip through afterwards. So until then, sure love you bunches. Bye.